Scottish, John's English, okay. And there's a there's a difference. Oh yeah. In that, oh, from sure. where you're from. Sure, that's right. The basic difference is that the Scottish and the Irish hate mm. the English. That's, that's right. But realize the only thing I know about you guys is in the movement. Mm. You know. Mm. I really. didn't I didn't speak English till I was six. Yeah. You changed the music when you was not supposed to. Mm -hmm. Well, we'll talk about that. Yeah. Don't distort the word of God. Uh, <laughs> well, we'll, yeah. get, we'll get to it all, yeah. okay? Yeah. Let's, let's just trust each other on everything. Okay. Sure. Okay. Sure. Okay. Sure. Okay. Sure. Okay. Sure. Okay. Sure. Okay. Now, I don't think in time, because I've been over 40 years in jail, I'm in Supreme Court at least 10 times. I'm three professors in penology, Psychology, philosophy, criminology, all theologies of Babylology, you know, and I got a lot of regular not speaking of Gaelic also on the side. I've been in Clover for a lot of years. And then I'm in the heart of the whole, from here to the bullrings of Spain, uh, that uh, uh, Sean Connery, or uh, whatever his name should know that by now, he's played my bagpipe off uh, from the Hindus murder case uh, at least three times in the, uh, in the literary perspective. Somebody once said you're the most dangerous man alive. Do you think you are? Well, I don't. Uh, that's ambiguous. It doesn't really make it. All men are dangerous. Mm -hmm. Maybe to themselves. You know, that's a uh, honor of his majesty. I mean, you're certainly one of the most famous people in the world, or someone with your name is. Yeah. Uh, right. Well, there's good reason for that. If it could be brought into the light, in the true perspective, with intelligent life forms, if there is such a thing on the planet Earth. Right. But a lot of people don't know you were a musician. That's a second. That's a game. Yeah. Well, let's talk about that just a little bit. You learned some guitar from... Uh, Creepy Al Carter, is that right? Uh, yeah. Alvin Carter, yeah. Mm -hmm. Alcatraz. And I swept the floor with Alcatraz. I've been in the federal judge for 22 years before I got to California. That's what I tried to explain to the court in California, but I haven't been able to find anyone in California yet. There doesn't seem to be anybody home. Did you start um, in San Francisco playing your guitar? And no, I started in Kentucky. Right. In uh, Moorhead, Kentucky, in uh, 1943. 
Some recording with him, didn't they? Huh? Did you did some recording with him? Do you remember yeah, doing yeah, all that? Yeah, they opened up their house, and mm -hmm. I went uh, through what they were doing, and I rejected it because I just got out of one prison, and I wasn't looking for another. Mm -hmm. And the lifestyle that they live is pretty much controlled by the business manager that runs from New York City and with a red Ferrari. Did they tell you about the red Ferrari? No. But the, the Beach Boys recorded one of your songs, though, didn't they? I think they recorded more than one. Which ones did they record? Uh, I don't remember. remember. I can't remember back that far. You yeah. know. Remember, it ceased to exist. Uh, the electricity, the light switches, and the and the uh, the uh, the electricity runs off of a brotherhood that runs off of a cross, that runs off of a piece of clover, that runs off of six six six, uh -huh. that runs up and down the hallways uh, in juvenile hall from Boys Town, uh, Nebraska. The light, the heart of man, runs the brotherhood from the cross. Okay. And um, the brotherhood is, um, on some levels, is very violent and very nasty and very mean. And there's a struggle for points of reality. Some people say that uh, Habarashtash from India is the living God, mm -hmm. you know? And I say, no, our Father, which are in heaven, is mm -hmm. the living God, you know? Mm -hmm. Then there's an argument, and then the fire is thrown on me, and I burn up for that, you know. Mm -hmm. And then Union Carbide blows up, and a whole mm -hmm. bunch of them burn up. And who's burning who up? And where mm -hmm. is the center of the music? Yeah. Let's, France, let's, let's keep on the music. Let's France wearing the pants yeah. with Elvis yeah. Cleaver and Huey Newton. Yeah. Uh, that, was all those, that was all in those days. But let's try and keep it's on. Still today, yeah. It's still today. It's still today. They're all fucking towards Michael Jackson. Yeah. And they're controlling the music with the abortion clinics, and okay. the, the music controls that little girl, you yeah. know? All right. Well, let's talk, you, you had your song that they had ceased to exist, and they changed it, didn't they? Remember, they changed the words? Yeah. You didn't like that? Oh, not at all, would you? No. 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 See, in prison, you write songs, and you send them to people outside, to Brother Recording Company. And when their Brother Recording Company gets them, mm -hmm. uh, they, don't, they don't exactly use the same... What they do is they, it's like, I wrote a song because I know, 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 I know. It's a meditation song. Right. I walk back and forth to myself and I say, will in the mind, body and soul. Will in the mind, body and soul. Will in the mind, the body and soul. And I'm fighting against the cell. I'm trying to keep my will up because years and years in a cell is difficult. Sure. So it becomes a song. And I write the song out, I send the song, I send a tape to someone, they send a tape to Brother Richard. 